진짜 너무 맛있어 <웃음> 제가 두 세살 이상 좋아하는데 제가 두 세살 연상을 좋아하는데 구별을 해야 할까요? 나 제가 두 세살 연상을 좋아하는데 구별을 해야 할까요? <웃음> So good, I'm both. But it sounds both good on both. Well, I think higher. Okay. Hello, JCS. Welcome back to another podcast episode. And today we are going to do Komin Sangdam. Yay! My name is Paul, <laughs> the host for today. I'm Christine. And I'm Keelan. And I'm David Yu. So we, we got some Komins uh, from. Students and teachers from JCS. Uh, the first one is I worry for my brother's grades. He plays video games all day, every day. Um, to uh, my solution for this is try to. Um, it's very hard to stop someone from playing a game, if especially if it's a boy. <laughs> uh, but in my personal opinion, I think it's good to not fight because it's better to have good relationship. It's good to um think of uh, think about your younger or older brother's um grades, but I think it's just good to leave them alone because it's their um uh life. Uh, also, uh, uh, someone said, uh, you can't nah, she cannot stop game. And actually, I don't play game anymore. I don't. I decided not to play game until I go to university. Is that possible? Oh yeah. yes, I I didn't oh play God. game for like few months. I think no, wow. three, months. three months. That's impossible. Three, four months. I I don't know. I forgot. Uh, uh how I how I stopped it is I really wanted to do game, and when you do when you do game, like constantly, then you will want to play game more. So what I did was I played game for seven days without thinking, and <laughs> and uh <laughs> and I I made promise with my mom. So my promise was, if I play game for seven weeks without studying, then I weeks. will I will never uh, I mean seven days. Seven <laughs> days I will never play game until I go to university, and. Wow. And I really did that, and I'm trying my best to not play game. And I didn't play game for a few months, and I feel like game is not fun, and I don't think it's like really needed. So I think that's one way to stop playing games. Wow. Okay, so I'll pick the next one. Uh, so it says. 인생 인생이 힘들어요 숙제 때문에. <laughs> uh, Christine, do you have a solution? Oh, uh, I know your life is really hard. Uh, but um, we're hard as well. Yes. <laughs> uh, everyone has a hard life sometimes, but you go to heaven in the end, right? Yeah. 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 Okay, David, you can yeah uh -huh. take a next. Oh, uh, next question is. I don't want to do I ready by fourth grade. Uh, I think what uh you have to do I ready, but if you don't want to do it and if you don't do it, you'll be scolded by a teacher, <laughs> and, I, and you don't want that. So I think doing I ready is very important because uh I like the word. Mm. Practice makes perfect. So Whoa. I think when you practice with already math or English, you will have better grades. <laughs> also, yeah. I'll give you a really good tip. If you finish all your lessons, you don't have to do already oh. forever. So this is really, really, really useful and good. So please try to finish all your lessons, and then you'll never have to do them. Yeah. No, but you have to do it again next semester. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if you Wait. pass the test. Well, well, after you finish it, already yeah. it's not gonna take the whole day. So you can after that you can play or uh, play, you what you want, play right, games, right, right. talk with friends. Oh, uh, yeah, it's very really good. Oh, uh, so this is from a teacher. So I am a teacher here at JCS, and I wanted to share one of my comments in hopes that you guys can help me solve it. Here, here it is. A problem that I run into daily is my students' hate of homework. Every day when it is time for me to tell the class what homework is, <laughs> they plead me with, 
uh, with me and try to make deals to get out of doing any. I can't, I can't not give homework. What should I do? To be honest, <laughs> I'm not. I'm not the kind of person no homework. I I still kind of think that uh, homeworks are needed. Mm-hmm. But yeah. as a teacher, it's very frustrating when kids are trying to like. Uh, make deals and things but I think it's just good to tell them it's for their future and then mm. they're going to regret if they don't learn it it's, I think it's it's a life it might teach a life lesson to them I guess but what? it doesn't always work for <laughs> little yeah. kids yeah Marisol you can make you can make the students to feel uh, they like homework so such as you can say, if you do homework really well, you can go to great university, like top, <laughs> top, top five university. <laughs> top five. Also, uh, when I, I don't really like my homeworks, but I can, you can uh, hypnotize yourself by oh, thinking okay. homework is the best thing, homework is the best thing, then you suddenly feel like oh, homework <laughs> is not really bad. Yes. I'm really glad it works for you, but it doesn't for me. Oh. No. He's built different, maybe. So here's the next Kumin and Ying Myung Nim. <laughs> um, <laughs> 제가 두세 살 연상을 좋아하는데 고백을 Ooh. 해야 할까요? Um, I don't think I I, <laughs> I don't think that it like 연상 matters with your Quebec, but yeah, very free. But in this school. Well, maybe it's not. Maybe he's he. In our, uh, maybe she or he is not in our school. Ah, like the person ah, that ah, the ah. he or she likes is not in the school. Mm-mm. Oh, probably yeah, because the school rules, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. But uh, the thing is, I think um you should if it's if this is happening in school. Wait until you graduate. <laughs> it's not the end of the world if you um miss that person, but maybe you can um age difference doesn't matter. So mm. nothing can stop love. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> nothing like can age, stop love. age um is nothing. So I think you can do it. But if it's in the school, think about after graduating. Mm. <laughs> Wise words. <laughs> yeah. Good. Good. Ah, uh, okay, I'll pick the next one. Will I get COVID? <laughs> so, uh, no. so, you might, it's like 50-50% chance, right? But yeah. even though you get COVID, it's not very scary or bad. You're not nah. going to die, so it's okay. Because I had it before, and it's not oh. very, it's not nice, but it's not <laughs> that bad. Yeah. So I think it's fine to get COVID, <laughs> but if you're really scared... Try to do try to clean your hands and everything often, and it will work out. Mm, good answer. I also got COVID too, and uh, is this okay? It feel like Nothing. you're normal, so you mm. don't. I didn't have any symptoms, so I didn't even cough. So I think you'll be fine if mm. even though you get COVID. Yes. Oh, uh, the next question is Sal Pen Undung Chichon by Ying Myung. So oh, very Ying uh, Myung name, very um yeah. good at uh, thank you for doing this coming So <laughs> Actually even though you play sport, it doesn't mean that you will you're be lighter. So uh I think it depends on your habit so you can mm. uh lessen your weight. So for me, I did swimming. I learned swimming and mm, I actually mm. gained more weight because I was so tired and I had to eat more. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, if you really want to lessen your weight by doing sports, uh, I will recommend you doing maybe basketball or fencing because for basketball, you can grow by jumping. And when you grow, your even though you eat a lot, your you will be lighter because you will go taller. And also for mm. fencing, it is very tired, but you feel like you don't want to eat because it's uh, you're so tired. Oh. So, 
Uh, you can yes. also do mm. things like stretching or yoga mm. um, if you don't really want to do lessons because they also help out. It helps your body to have flexibility and it still oh. helps you a lot. And, and also, if you want to be lighter, just change your habit. So, mm. daily yes. habits. Don't eat a lot. Like, don't eat like snacks a lot. Oh, okay. Maybe you'll be. Yes. Oh, the next uh, comment is why is tying my hair so hard? Uh, I'm not a. I don't have a. I don't have long hair. I'm pretty sure this person was a girl, <laughs> so I will ask somebody who has long hair. Uh, Christine used yes. to have long hair. Yeah. yeah I used to. Um, but I don't usually not. I don't usually tie my hair, but you do, so I can. Oh, I so you can tying your hair. So in when you tie your hair into a ponytail, oh. it, it's not that hard. But if you're gonna do stuff like braiding, pigtails, or stuff like that, it gets a little more complicated. But you could always ask your parents to mm. help you, cause they will. They I'm pretty sure they'll be better than. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and even though it's hard, as you grow older, it will be better. Practice makes perfect. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the next comment is 숙제를 왜 해야 하는지 고민입니다. <laughs> Doing homeworks will improve improve your skill. And if you want to improve your skill, do homework. Very simple. Oh, I that's so wow. amazing. Um, I think we have reached the end for this week. Uh, we'll come with another fun episode next week, so uh, be ready. Bye. 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 Stop making me laugh. Honey, who, who I do. You guys, what the fights <laughs> were <laughs> doing? Honey, think about it. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Christine, do you do homework? Toby, honey, I'm not doing it.